J. This is the Arcade, and we're playing Link's Awakening again. Um, we left off. We did two dungeons back to back yesterday, and um, interesting happenstance today. Uh, I was going to get new HDMI cables, hoping that they would fix the video connection issue with the uh, capture card. But when the delivery from Amazon arrived, it was a pair of lady shoes instead. And not even like nice ones. They look kind of cheap. So I have no idea what they thought. Uh, how you could confuse three foot HDMI cable with uh, lady shoes. I uh, uh, don't know. But that's what happened. So I decided that I would run out and grab my own HDMI cables. And I went to my local place and I picked up some, I would think, pretty high end ones. And I did a little test this afternoon. It seems to be working, but we'll find out. Um, but yeah, we got some pigs to deal with. We also have the seashell mansion here that we're going to jump into. Because, as you may have noticed, I spent a little time and went and got the other seashells we needed for the next reward. So we're going to jump in here and get that. What do we get? What do we get? Raise your sword overhead. I shall grant you new power. Ooh, shiny. You got the Kohalent sword. You should put your name on it right away. Ooh. So now we have double damage on top of double damage. And if we get a piece of power, we'll get double damage on top of that. As well as we now shoot laser arrows, it looks like. Or no, that's the sword. Okay. I, I, I get it now. We're all good. So, now we have that. Um, there was something that I totally missed here. Which may come in handy later. It legitimately doesn't seem as relevant in this particular version of the game, but... Eh, I guess it still helps in its way. Um, there's a song over here. I forgot to go this way, but we're gonna go in that cave with the fishes. I'm just gonna look over here real quick, see if there's anything lurking. something hidden underwater. Oh, that's a waterfall. We do not want to go there just yet. Check that out in a minute. Um, but yeah, there's a song here that used to allow you to teleport to one or two locations, I think. And it lets you go back to the beginning of a dungeon. I am Manbo, child of the sunfish. Have you got an ocarina? Hey, you bet I do. Ah ha ha! Then I can teach you my song, Bloop. Here we go.
learn Manbo's Mambo. When you get out of the water, play it. And warp to a warp point around the island. Try this tune in Dungeons 2. Since today's a special day, I'll let you warp to Mambo's Pond, too. Oh, really? So I guess that makes this more effective. Because that'll let you go to any of the warp points. <laughs> oh yeah, we explored up this way a little bit, looking for seashells. So we almost have the whole map now, minus this section and this section. Uh, now, we're going to go to the animal village. Itchy nose. Because there's some stuff we can do, I believe. Now that we have the hook shot, we can get over the, um, what you call it? There's a bridge that we need to get over. Or not a bridge, rather, there's a gap that we need to get over. And here we go. We put the scale in. Oh, something hit me. Oh, how about that? We got the magnifying lens. This will reveal many things you couldn't see before. Yet. magnifying glass. I'm not a troublemaker. I just want to live in peace. I'll give you this if you promise to keep your mouth shut. Take a seashell. Nice. <laughs> promise is a promise, okay? Hey, you should head out to the cave at Tarambo Shores. Use the magnifying glass there and you can find someone else like me. Alright. Give it a look. We got, we got some money. And a little bit of more money. Awesome. So we need to go to the beach. It'll be the fastest way to get there. Monkey. 
Monkey. Well, hello there, sir. I found a good item washed up on the beach. I'll trade it to you for what you have in your X or Y, but... On trade, press X or Y. If you don't, press B. Huh? Okay, whatever. Well, well sir. Hey. I will give you that shovel. <laughs> we got the boomerang. We like the boomerang. Tell you your shovel back. That's 300 rupees sound. Yeah, sure. Get your shovel back. The world was once again your dig site. <laughs> nice. All right, so we got that. Uh... That one is. Still have a couple of keys to get. Got our red mail. Also think we'd be able to go to Sign those mechs. Why you gotta hit me like that? That's not very nice. So we have this Dark Secrets and Mysteries of Kohalit. Yes, let's read it. Round and round the passageways of the egg. We're gonna screenshot that. Just like before, I'm gonna take a picture of it. So I am not gonna remember. We need it for later. Also, weird side note that I just thought of. I had a snake in my apartment. I mean, it, just a little bitty garter snake. It couldn't have been more than eight or nine inches long. Skinnier than a pencil, but all up in the wires for my computer. Just coiled up there, hanging out like he belonged. And I went to try and get him outside and he scurried away somewhere and then I went into my bathroom later and he's just staring at me from the corner so I finally caught him and got him outside but like what is up with that like hey, outside you go outside do not hang out in here Uh, 
this sign here. It's a very drawn out thing. You did it. Your reward is this way. Cool. What's up, Wart? Or Mamu? I know who you are. Your witness protection program isn't going to save you in this game. I know what you did in fake Mario 2. Ribbit, ribbit. I'm Mamu on vocals. But I don't need to tell you that, do I? Everybody knows me. Want to hang out and listen to us jam? Three. Oh. I'll pay. I don't have enough money there. Don't play for free. All right, fine. I'll go get some cash. Ah, oh, here it is. Ultimate power. It's a good thing we don't need, like, terribly too much as far as the money goes. Look at that, we got a, a good once around and we're almost there already. Let's come back around here and go, okay, let's do the loop again. We only needed, what, 14, I think? I need you to regrow here a little bit. Alright, one more. We got this. Alright, there's our 300. Let's go talk to... Move. 
Yeah, here you go. Take my money. Let's hear this jam. Been a wonderful audience. No encores. Croak. You learn the frog song of soul. It's a very moving tune. It can even liven up unliving things. If you play this song, you'll make everything around you feel more alive. Cool. That was totally not worth 300 rupees, but yeah, got to do what you got to do. So, time for round two of the Fae Shrine. Because it turns out that I was doing it the right way before, but there's no indication that you're doing any damage until the shield breaks. So, I thought I wasn't doing anything, but I was. It's just being impatient is what it was. So, if we go back to the animal village. bow and arrow stuff. Give me my ammunition. Over here. Guy's not doing anything. We already went over there. I think we're 
we're gonna do it this time. We add on arrows. We are loaded up on arrows. To the Finder, the Isle of Coholent is but an illusion. Human, monster, sea, sky, a scene on the lid of a sleeper's eye. Awaken the dreamer and Coholent will vanish much like a bubble on a needle. Castaway, you should know the truth. What? Illusion? doesn't show us. That's a shame. The, uh, the layout of this room, like all three of these rooms, actually looks like a top-down view of, uh, the windfish. It's pretty cool. What's up, Alface? First time this episode, huh? I see you have read the relief. Uh, ironic that they used the word relief for that because it was anything but relieving. That's more stressful than anything. Well, it does say the island is but a dream of the windfish. No one is really sure. You cannot know if a chest holds treasure until you open it. So you cannot tell if this is a dream until you awaken. So this is Schrodinger's Legend of Zelda game. All right, I got you. Only one who knows for sure is the wind pit. Trust your feelings. Someday you will discover the answer. All right. That was less than helpful. My boomerang. So that is super helpful. Wow, that like doubled up on him. Let me go. I'm so speedy fast. Out of the way. We do not have time or patience. Yeah. <laughs> 
I'm getting the money. Oof. I'll take that fairy. Price of one throw. Didn't bring anything back. Oh well. <laughs> this one did though. What's up, fairy lady? Plenty of pep come see me when you can't go on. Will do. It never comes to that. Heck, these things are handing out fairies like they're candy. Six fish fries. All right. Got okay. That makes that easier. Money that uh, lost on Mambo. <laughs> yeah, we just we have all the fairies now. I think we're gonna be good. Me. 
Oh, that's not going to work on him, is it? bracelet. You feel like you could lift an elephant. Well, that's incredibly convenient since I have elephant statues all over the place. stuff already. Yes, we need to go to the left here. Got to start going to the right down there. Those parts where they're at. Wait, we want to go this way, yeah? There's the switch. all over the place. It's this way. Beak! Alright, we got a beak. That's basically all that's in there. navigation stuff the last couple of dungeons. Oh my god, I definitely need those bombs. Let's check this out real quick. What is here? Ha 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 ha. So we need to flip that switch and then come down here. Hey, more bombs. Nice. need to go up that last room it's basically this whole side of the dungeon yeah. 
now that this is open, do one of those. Now, I don't really know how these work. figured those out, but I think, I think it's as easy as, you see how the floor is checkered here? You have to throw them in a way that the knight would move. Like I, for the life of me, when I was playing the original, I never understood how those things worked. It just seemed completely random. That's a seashell. Get anything to get stuff up. We're right there. Dang. Oh well. It's all good. I don't even need to hit that thing. Do I? Just come right back down this way. Oh, wait. Is it? It is blocked off. Okay. So we do. We need to hit the switch in order to means we'll have to go... Dang it. Direct. Now we can go back around. Not mess with any of these. a key. We have not run into anything that requires a key yet. So that's got to be over here somewhere. But we have one when we need it. Y'all have fun with that. I'm going over here. Top of the crystals to move forward. Huh. 
yet you say that, I have them in the wrong orientation to begin with. So unless there is which the orientation of that up here, I'm gonna have to go all the way around again. Oh, there's a key. And there's a second key that we have. There's a third key up there. Cool. So how do we get to that door? There's a whole lot of this stuff over here. So we're going to have to go in this neck of the woods. Oh, how to get over there. There's got to be staircases and tunnels and things. Oh, you're all back. this mini boss because it just looks like an adorable little critter that wants to play and you smack it with a big metal ball and that always made me kind of sad that it seemed like it was totally innocent like oh it's cute it just wants to play Here's a staircase. It's just loops, does it? Okay. I see you. It's kind of weird, not gonna lie. going to supply a key as well. Where are we? Yeah. I think we're going to go this way first. So the other way looks like it just leads to the, the nightmare room. throw it from here, it'll just fall over. But if I throw it from here, oh, it's a little further. 
further back, is it? Okay, I got you. I don't know if that has to be thrown from its corresponding color or not. I thought I had it figured out. I was wrong. Because that's totally not how a knight would move. That was like a whole extra... Voice, huh? Oh. I'm supposed to hurt these. So I think I gotta use the pot, right? Is that Mambo nonsense? All right, so we are on white tile. Okay. So that'll go that way. So yeah, we'll just. I'm going to need this to be down. I don't know why exactly, but... Find out. I'm guessing it has to do with going this way. I'll need it oriented either one way or the other. I may have to come back here and switch it back the other way. I might have just screwed myself over. Uh, that's where we came in here. Hello. Now I just need to be aware of when you're hungry again.
That takes care of that. They weren't so hard. We have the key to get over there. can open the door to the nightmare's lair. All right, owl face, what do you have to say? To open a church chest, use the pots around. Really? Now you tell me? And so we have all of that. orientation or if I have messed things up they are in the correct orientation this is gonna chase me hey you found some secret medicine but you already have some, so let's put this back. <laughs> um. So. Go here. Try and go back to the beginning. Yeah, back to the beginning. Here. Which I think brings us out there. how we want to do this. That's it. It is not. That was not how we wanted to do that so I think we have to go back the other way now and go in here I think. How did we get to this one see I wish it would tell you 
how the staircases connect. I think that's a feature in the Dampy and his building the dungeon thing. It will actually tell you how the staircases are related to each other. where I want to be. We're good. Oh, that doesn't work. Lasered in the face. Got everything. This is the only thing that didn't get open because we thought I'd get one. It's very nice. I gotta do it. There's two of these torches that are not lit. <laughs> again. Facade. fish wakes up, everything on this island will be gone forever. And I do mean everything. Well, you don't say. instrument the coral triangle first mystical musical instrument ever <laughs> mountain give you a mountain Something calls from the mountains. I'm sure it does. Where's he at? The many monsters of this island fear that the windfish is about to awaken. 
The monster's power is real. It may conquer the island and destroy their foes. That day may come soon. Now go to the mountain tower. Fly like a bird. Hoot, hoot. Really? I'm gonna fly to the mountain. ride has opened up because we were like right here so we gotta figure out all this stuff oh where to go where to go let's go under this guy Explore a little bit, see if we can find anything. So we're over by Richard's castle now. This is all the way up in the mountains. Guarantee we've got some trendy game stuff. Anything interesting in here yet? Or are you still just selling those tiles? Nope, still selling tiles. this thing to its new home. Just don't ask what's under the mask. It's nothing under the mask. It's a void. It's the deepest, darkest part of someone's soul. Peer into it and not go mad. That goes right here, I'm pretty sure. him right there so that's that one that one we need a pokey in this spot I think the only other one we need is in here Yeah, we need the piranha plant for this one. Pokey and a piranha plant. And I think Ulrira has both of his. So we got the blooper and the cheap cheap, yeah? Yeah, it's just those two. Okay. So we should be good there. Let's go, uh, out of the way, chicken. Cool. 
flying rooster, you say? Is there anything else? Still don't know what that is. I would imagine that's going to be a third jar. Be the last key. That I don't know. Or no, that's the spot for whenever we have a statue. So that that's what that is. for me. Magic flute. We've successfully performed necromancy. Neat. The rooster has recovered. He seems very friendly. I didn't resurrect his butt for nothing. So what have... So I think we want to go to Dampy Shack for this. Getting restless. All right. Say so, bird face. This is a dead end, but you can see the key over there. Of 
bird face. Take me over here. And now we got the bird key. So we're all good to go. Come on, get over here. We gotta go home now. So we have bird key. Discount Luigi. Amazing. That rooster is actually flying. It's just like I said, eh? Have you tried to hold him over your head? Uh, you bet I have. Checked out the dresser. Yep, everything checks out. I don't know. Something a little weird about that guy. Gotta do a little bit of exploring. We go on to the next place. Oh, hey. Speak of the next place. down to uh, any of the warp points. So where do we want to go? We need... Yeah, we want to go here. <laughs> the chicken is spinning too. See this? This we gotta go over this way. Yes, we know what this is. Secret seashell. Cool. Just jump in the water here. Oh hey. Good thing I did. There's a piece of art there. where we lost that fairy last episode. It got yeeted into the moat here. Big secrets in the waterfall. Big secrets in the waterfall. Okay. Let me pick up the chicken. That'll work yeah. faster. All right, we haven't talked in a little bit. What do you got for me? Bring, bring all right out here. Yes, when I was just a lad, I recall seeing a high tower in the mountains. You should go there. Is that helpful for you? Bye. Click. Well, I mean, it is helpful, I guess. Yeah.
Oh, nice. Got two of them with one shot there. We have. We have 43 seashells. So we've only got seven more. I know a couple of them are in the rapids ride, so I will have to do that eventually to get them all. Uh, but yeah, we're heading up this way, I think. Since I happen to go exploring, it's going to be a little easier to get up there. Hit him. Oh, hey. There is bombable wall right there that I did not see. Oh, hey. How you doing? Got a fairy phone. I love it when there's an easy access fairy phone. So this way. Don't want to go that way. Go this way. Is it this way? I might be wrong. Yeah, that looks like the right way. How are you missing the bats? about skull face looking, you know, cavern here. sometime, and I will see you around the world.